good defense. Points to come. Concentrate, focus, power. Remember, balance. Make good fight. Warning for running out of the ring. Once more, toss to the point. What's going on, guys? After years of researching, if there's one thing you're not gonna get from this channel, intelligent, well spoken, flat earth. If there's one thing you're not gonna get from this channel, because believe me, because believe me, one thing you're not gonna get. Crusader is for truth. Yeah, 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 Tune into the one and only Shell Studies. Okay. Don't, feel Don't get me wrong. You should maintain a level of awareness and prudence, especially if you're not an operative or an insider. I haven't been given the green light from any lodge or synagogue. I have nothing to save my ass. When black suits and badges come asking questions, it's fear porn. It's fear porn. My last name isn't. It's fear porn. It's fear porn. Handshakes. So that's one reason why I choose to remain a voice. I don't want to endanger my family. It's fear porn. It's fear porn. I'm serious. I'm not playing games. I'm gonna go as far as God will let me. The Creator of all things. Yahweh. Anybody uh, familiar with that camp? The uh, Yahawashai camp. Oh, they only seem tailor fitted to make Jaren and IPS look great. Let's see. Let's see if I can boil it down to the uh, to the archetypal uh, uh, essence. I should say. Um, Chill stoppers. Chill stoppers. That's a channel I want to watch because uh, I'm sure he's called out so many shills that are now no longer. Thank goodness we called them all out. Um, yeah, shill stoppers. That's a channel I want to watch. Chill stoppers. Um, that's a channel I want to watch. What exactly um, it is that uh, they're so disappointed in? Jaren um, and IBS. Here um, the Bell syndrome. Um, Crusaders for Truth versus the religious cult of. Yahweh. If this isn't staged, um, then it's just um, playing out perfectly to me. Those two shine. shine Here's my take on uh, Jaren. Take it or leave it. If he's your daddy, stop the vid. Watch something else. Okay, Jaren comes off as innocent, intelligent, well spoken, and I'll give him credit for all of that but one. Ah! He's not innocent. Jaren is in it for the money, that's obvious. He's got multiple streams of income, Flat Earth is one of them. Don't get fooled by his boyish voice, his inflections. Jack Innocence extremely well, but it's a mask. You don't have to believe me, that's fine, but it's a mask. He's a wannabe warlock, witch, dark magician, whatever you want to call it. He hates God. That's why this Yoshi cult is there. The Yoshi cult is a straw man of us, the God believers. And Jaren and IBS are beating it like a pe- Not staged, they're gonna cash in on it. You know what was the number one red flag for the Yoshi cult? When I heard that if you don't call God Yoshi, this, this name I've never heard before, if you don't worship Yoshi, you're going to hell. That's a sure sign of enlightenment, huh? See, I got a problem with that because, you know, because, you know, because you know, throughout time, names have always been descriptive because names are words, people. Like, she lets their So what is the true name of God? It's not Billy, is it? The true name of God to me is... Yahawashai! Yeah. Yeah. So let me get this straight. 
Mr. SS, Mr. Shill Stutters, you're telling me that you have to remain anonymous to protect yourself and your family? <laughs> I, uh, I don't mean to overstand you in this moment, but I will. Because guess what, friend? Guess what, buddy? People that you are supposedly fighting against know who you are. <laughs> Just because you don't believe they can manipulate the weather doesn't mean they have every phone and every camera and every speaker around you tapped. <laughs> what a joke. This is, uh, I have to apologize. I have to apologize to my subscribers, to my friends, and to my family. This is a surely embarrassing moment. I have never seen such a sad, pathetic excuse for a COINTEL agent such as the shill the dutters. It's not even that you call the name of the creator Yoshi or mock him. It's that you're out here proclaiming to be the true followers of God while you promote Satan. Look at these graphics you got here. Your mask, your flames, your devils. Who, who are we getting here? Who are you trying to fool? You trying to fool me? Are you trying to fool my subscribers? And let me get this straight. You think the true Paleo-Hebrew phonetically spelled creator's name, Yahawashai, is set up for Jaron Campanella and IPS to somehow slay. <laughs> oh, you know what, showstoppers? You are the guy lifting up Jaron and IPS off the ground and telling them, good job. You, you really got knocked out good there. Good job. The way you hit the ground, that was all right. <laughs> you are a sick pathetic Satanist. So we almost seem to to make Jaredism and IPS look great. Yes, look great. I don't know who you're trying to sell that to. Let's see let's see if I can boil it down to the uh, to the archetypal so let's boil it down essence. to the archetypal essence. And you know, the truth is stranger than fiction. And to be completely frank with you, I think you're a sad excuse for a liar you got you got the same patreons and and style as your your old pal jerry you are fake controlled christian opposition you're now tuned into the one and only shill studders shill studders you're now Tuned into the one and only Shill Studders. Shill Studders. Watch something else. Okay, Jaren comes off as innocent, intelligent, well spoken, and I'll give him credit for all of that but one. <laughs> Red flag. Jaren does not come off as innocent, well spoken, a slimy snake oil salesman, just as satanic as you. Let's keep this going. Don't get fooled by his boyish voice, his inflections project innocence extremely well. I am not fooled by his boyish projections and his inflections, well, they make me sick. Just like your satanic stupidity, you make Christians sick. You make me sick. You know, at this part of the video, I'm really starting to wonder how people believe that you're actually against Jaren. It, it almost sounds like you're him or you're in love with him. And, uh, you know. He's a wannabe warlock, witch, dark magician, whatever you want to call it. He hates God. That's why this Yoshi you cult the is there. Witch. Jaren is just a wannabe. And if you didn't truly hate God, you would have done the research and realized that the, the letter J wasn't invented until after the 1600s. 
The original name of the creator was Yahawa. Okay, he exists. You can find it in the Paleo Hebrew texts over 7,000 times, big boy. And get this Joshua, the son of Nun, that actually delivered the Israelites into the promised land of milk and honey. Suppose a Christian you are, Joshua means Yahawashai. So get that in your big blue brain. You're no bully. You're no shield stopper. You couldn't stop a stop sign. You are a joke. You are a failed, pathetic, Mossad, Cointel, fake, satanic, wimp, bully, hide your face coward. You mean nothing. You don't even show your face, buddy. You put a voice mask over your voice. The truth is stranger than fiction. You are not relevant. You hide. You can't be out here proclaiming truth and hide your face. Like, you. Oh, I'm scared. I'm sc- I've given up everything in my life. I am not afraid. Where have you gone? What have you done? How long have you been here, Mr. Shill Stutters? Where's your flat earth proofs? How many years have you been researching curvature and cartography and, and working to network true Christians and find people that are truly seeking? You've done nothing. You are pathetic. And this video is flat smacking you back to Fay Pay and Jeremy's satanic cloth. They can come out here and try to pretend that you're something that you're not. Um. Shill stop. Um, that's a channel I want to watch because uh, I'm sure he's called out so many shills that are now no longer. Thank goodness we called them all. Out. Why? Oh, where's the wheel? Where's the wheel? Oh my god! Oh! 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 <laughs> and what? You think waving a red flag? You know the very fact that you picked on an autistic person? You brought an autistic person into this? Pathetic. Autistic people have more morals and more more in the kingdom of heaven than you'll ever have. You're gonna pay for that, big boy. And every word you shill stutter, Yahawashai will be there every moment. The Yoshi cult is a straw man of us, the God believers. And Jaren and IBS are beating it like a pinata. (laughs) If it's not... You're calling yourself a God believer and you don't even research his true name? You call him Yoshi? You are a pathetic... them up off the ground like a broken pinata. We already destroyed their Jesuit Knights of Columbia scam fake rockets, buddy. Who are you? You're just out here. Your job. <laughs> oh, this is so rich. Oh, boy. I wonder what they think of you in the, in the club <laughs> that you're in, buddy. I, I don't know. Listen here. Listen here. We are going to be here long after your shill stuttering being is sent in hell. You can't lie to me. I see through your games, buddy. Some other people out here that you're poisoning might not, but I see right through you. You're nothing but a coward. Did you think you were just going to show up into the scene and no one would actually call you out? Is that why you're putting in this video? You'll never see my face. I'm so scared for my family. I'm so afraid. Come on, man. Quit the shit. You know the technology they have. You're purposely hiding because you're not relevant. You're an irrelevant agent. Anyone can see that all you're doing here is trying to prop up Jaren and IPS. So when you type into the in- online shill stoppers or Jaren is a shill, you're going to get this stupid video where you're saying his voice inflections 
are sweet and soft. And it's time he comes out of the satanic closet. Well, guess what, friend? There's going to be a video beside your name and a video beside his name. And it's going to say satanic shill exposed and stopped. Shill stutters is stopped. You got that? And I think we should get into the real meat and potatoes of the situation. Second grade, when the teacher would make us all sit in a circle and read parts of a storybook, we all take a paragraph each, and, you know, now it's ODD's turn. When you put out your video, she'll stopping ODD, a known convicted rapist, right? Right? You took it down. And I commented on your thread... And you said YouTube edited that out of your video. You are busted. Content creators know YouTube can't edit videos. YouTube doesn't have the right to edit my video. You lied. You're a shill. And that's why you're making this video. Because you're trying to prop up Jaren. Because your team is pathetic. You guys are getting destroyed. You guys don't even have a team anymore. They're not even, they're dead. They've been stomped. You have been stomped. You got that? You want to keep spreading your lies? We're going to be here every step of the way, buddy. And I'm no keyboard warrior. I show my face. My name is Ronnie James Harris. Of the one true creator God unlike you you wouldn't be out here putting handicapped people in your video trying to make fun of the name of the creator are you joking you wouldn't be lying about editing videos YouTube doesn't edit videos you piece of sh well-spoken innocent intelligent flat earth if there's one thing you're not gonna get from this channel Crusader is for truth, because believe me. Now I'm going to make this really simple and clear to you, shill stutters and liarism, because obviously you're not going to do the research. Proto-Hebrew was unambiguous. The language had a single vowel, ah. Watch this. Sanskrit vocalizes each consonant with a ah without specifically marking that sound. So now, when you read the Bible and understand the YHWH, you simply know that you add the AH sound between each consonant. Yahawa. Yahawa. That's the Most High's name in ancient Hebrew. God said moreover unto Moses, Thus shalt thou say unto the children of Israel, The Lord God of your fathers, the God of Abram, and the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob, hath sent me unto you. This is my name forever. And this is my memorial unto all generations. Let's take a closer look at that word capitalized in yellow, Lord, in ancient Hebrew. Exodus 3.15 And God said, Moreover unto Moses, Thus shalt thou say unto the children of Israel, The Lord... Notice the word Lord in all caps, written in yellow. The Hebrew is Yahweh. Lord God, stop! Once again, the word LORD in all capitals throughout the entire Bible means Yahweh. It says Yahweh, God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob hath sent me unto you. So now, let's go back, because long before Moses, the name Yahweh is found in our scriptures. 
Genesis 4.25 And Adam knew his wife again, and she bare a son, and called his name Seth. For God said she hath appointed me another seed instead of Abel, whom Cain slew. What does that word Lord say in the Hebrew? Yahweh. So men have been calling upon the name of Yahweh since the time of Adam and Eve. So now let's get one more witness. Let's go to Genesis 12, 8. And he removed from thence unto a mountain on the east of Bethel and pitched his tent, having Bethel on the west and high on the east. And there he builded an altar unto the Lord and called upon the name of the Lord. Hebrew says, Waya Kora'a Basham Yahawa. Okay, one more witness. Watch this. Genesis 15 and 2. And Abram said, Lord God, what wilt thou give me, seeing I go childless? And the steward of my house is this Eliza of Damascus. Genesis 15 7. And he said unto him, I am the Lord that brought thee out of Ur. I am the Lord. I am the Lord that brought thee out of Ur of the Chaldees. Again, what does that say in Hebrew? Again, what does that say in Hebrew? Waya Amar al Yawa on Ya Yahawa. I am Yahawa. Anyone who denies the name Yahawa, I'd like you to ask him this one question. What is the Hebrew pronunciation of the word Judah? Yahawada. To bear witness of the name Yahawa, I go to Genesis 29 35. And she conceived again and bare a son. And she said, Now will I praise the Lord. Now in Hebrew, Papa I'm Awada Ath Yahawa. Therefore she called his name Judah and left bearing. Al Khan Kora'a Shamwa Yahawada. That's Judah Yahawada. Notice again that the word Lord capitalized, highlighted in yellow, is Yahawa. It's just so simple, ladies and gentlemen, truth seekers and such. All you have to do is a small bit of research and you can find out the Hebrew YHWH is the verb Hawa, meaning to exist, with the prefix Y, meaning he. Therefore, the word YHWH means he exists. So now we take a look at the sound I, which is also known today as Ayan in the Hebrew. So now this sets up the last name that we need to discuss. Clean out your ears, stop stuttering chills and liarisms and pay attention. We've just established the name Yahawa is the most high. Now we will find the name of the only begotten son of the Most High. The name is Yahawashai. So now, trying to understand the name of the only begotten son, we look to Acts 7.44. Our fathers had the tabernacle of witness in the wilderness, as he had appointed, speaking unto Moses that he should make it according to the fashion that he had seen. Now, we look at Acts 7.45, which also our fathers that came after brought in with Jesus into possession of the Gentiles, whom God drave out before the face of our fathers unto the days of David. So we know 
that the one we call Jesus wasn't in Acts with Moses in the wilderness. So what are they talking about with Jesus? What they're really meaning is the name Joshua. Joshua and Jesus are the same name. Jesus is just the Greek transliteration of the name Joshua. Joshua was a leader after Moses passed on. Joshua was the one who delivered the people into the land of milk and honey, into the promised land. These are the names of the men which Moses sent to spy out the land, and Moses called O'Shea, the son of Nun, Jehoshua. Now we know there's no G or O or U sound in the ancient Hebrew, so what does that name Jehoshua mean? Who's this O'Shea? Let's look it up. Oh, here it is. The name Hosea. Hosea or Hosea or O'Shea equals salvation. Family name of Joshua, the son of Nun. Let's look up the name O'Shea in the lexicon. It's number 1954. Here it is. Hawashai. Ha shai Now let's look at Numbers 1316 again. These are the names of the men which Moses sent to spy out the land, and Moses called O'Shea, the son of Nun, Jehoshua. Let's look at what that is in Hebrew. Hawashai. This is the same verse below in Hebrew. Look at the yellow. The name O'Shea, which is Hawashai, was changed to the name Yahawashai. The name of the Savior is Yahawashai. Thus, similarly, like we added Ya to Hawa, we add the Ya to the word Hawashai, which means He is salvation. Look here once more, Zechariah 3.8. Hear now, O Joshua the high priest, thou and thy followers that sit before thee, for they are men wandered at. For behold, I will bring forth my servant, the branch. The name Yahawashai was also referenced to the high priest. The high priest was the one who offered up sacrifice for our sins. And that is why Yahawashai offered up his life to deliver us from our sins.
Watch me flip that Okay. Oh, nigga, I'm... Oh.